Hey YouTube, it's Justin here, aka Demonic Sweaters. Got a little product review for you guys today. We're going to be taking a look at this Ace Mic wireless guitar system. This is the G1 transmitter and receiver. Uh, basically, it's just a wireless setup for a guitar. Um, they did send it to me for free, but I'm going to let you know what I really think. Um, as much as I can. I mean, it's not like I'm going to be on a stage or anything like that. But I am going to test it out here at home with my guitar and my little Joyo uh, rechargeable amplifier. I'm going to try to walk around my apartment as far as I can. And uh, it's a pretty big apartment, so we'll be able to test the range a little bit. And uh, maybe I can even walk out into the hallway. Neighbors might be looking at me like I'm crazy, but I'll give it a shot and see how far I can go. Uh, all right, let's go. Actually, I don't know how. Well, maybe I'll bring a different camera with me. That's what I can do. I'll record myself with my phone while I'm walking around. And definitely if the neighbors see me, they'll definitely think I'm crazy. So what I'm doing here is opening up this box slowly. <laughs> there we go. And let's take a look. I might have to charge it before I can do anything. So we've got two things here, two plugs. They have quarter inch guitar jacks on each. So you just plug one into the amp, one into the guitar. And then there's a power button on both right there. And that seems fairly simple. Uh, maybe I should look at the manual just in case there's something that I don't know, but I would imagine you just plug it in and turn it on. It should work, I would think. Okay, so inside of the manual, it says that the frequency band is 2.4 gigahertz. And uh, is that the same as Wi-Fi? Uh, 2.4 gigahertz. I don't know. Is that the same as Wi-Fi internet? Tell me down below if you know. Uh, wireless distance says 30 meters. I have no idea what that is because I'm American and all I know are feet. <laughs> so, uh, lithium ba battery capacity, 600 milliamps. Uh, continuous working time, six hours. That's pretty cool. Charging time, two hours. Uh, sample rate is 24 bit for 48 kilohertz, uh, which is good. Uh, frequency response, 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz. That's more than enough for the for a guitar. And dynamic range is. 0.5% 1 kilohertz at 10 uh, dB FS. I really don't know what that means. Uh, it's kind of technical stuff. Latency less than 5 milliseconds. Uh, so that seems pretty good. Let's check it out. All right, so I've got it hooked up here. One side's plugged into my guitar. The other is plugged into the amp. I'm going to go walk into the other room and get a pick. Okay, so I'm in the other room here, and you can walk back in the living room. It's kind of hard to walk and film here. I'm gonna test like some playing too, so I get an idea of the latency or how that feels like. But um, I already walked, actually let's walk as far as I can to the other side of my apartment. Still working. I mean, unless you're Bon Jovi or something, I highly doubt you're going to be on a stage that's that big. Uh, but I am going to I'm going to set the phone down and walk outside uh, out into the hallway of the building, and uh, just so I can pull. Well, let me see what I can do here. <laughs> this is a little awkward. Uh, I almost walked out there without my keys. I better go get my keys. So I'm going to set the phone down. Let's just put it here. Okay, I got my keys. Actually, I'm gonna have to take the phone with me because otherwise, how are we gonna know when it cuts off? Or how far I am when it cuts off? So, don't set the keys there. Take them with you, idiot. Okay. There we go. So I'm just gonna walk down the end of the hallway here. Pretty far. Man. I think that's fine. Unless 
you're like under a stadium or something, there's no way you're gonna be that far. The neighbors play some pretty loud music. That's okay though. Doesn't bother me. All right, so that's the distance test. Seems, uh, well, actually, I don't know. I don't know until I watch it back, but let's do some playing. Ah! Let's do some playing here. Um, but I don't really notice, there's no noticeable latency for me. Of course, I'm not like a really fast shredder guitar player or anything. The palm muting seems good. I mean... No noticeable issues. It's a little, it's not beautiful on the guitar, but it's not terrible looking. I mean, you could kind of point it up or down. I don't know which way that looks the best. You don't really notice it that much when you're playing. I can't remember how much it costs, so I'll put it up on the screen, uh, but I know it's not very expensive. So I think if you're looking for a inexpensive uh, wireless guitar system, this is a good option. I mean, I don't really have anything to compare it to, but it seems like it works. And uh, it's kind of nice to be able to walk around without a cable. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Don't forget to click like, subscribe, all that BS, and I'll see you all in the next video. Have a great day. Later.